I'm Jax. Welcome back to Stupid Stupid. Hi, I'm Nicola. Are you going to say it or am I going to oh, say it? The, the dick pic. The classic dick pic that Why? women just really want to see in their inbox. No! <laughs> it possesses you. I know you've got a theory on this, haven't you? You imagine that some woman... Actually, I mean, I know we blame the men for this, but I think there's got to be a woman out there that initially said, well, okay, what's your postcode? Or I'll be round in a minute. <laughs> it seems to be a thing. And I've known loads of people that have had it. I mean, I've woken up once on my Facebook Messenger and I've seen a dick more than you wanted to. <laughs> but the worst thing is, is there's no warning. You just open it. You could oh, be anywhere. God. You could be yeah. sat in a cafe. You could be sat with your mum. I know. Na- it, the online version of the old school Rain Mac flusher. <laughs> Do you know what Isn't it? It seems like more acceptable. I'm pretty sure. Someone told me there was law against it, but I'm like, come on, that there can't be because how... Because it's so prevalent. It is no different to somebody coming up to you in the street and putting um, a pants. Yeah. Maybe they just want a rating. Do you know? <laughs> God forbid that a woman should give a man a rating. I ever see that again. I might say, is that a <laughs> chipolata? <laughs> I like chipolatas too. Maybe they will stop. anti chipolata <laughs> I, I think is my my bitch head comes into play. Gonna, right. I'm going to say, pass me the pair of tweezers and a magnifying glass. <laughs> Men, seriously, just because you want to see our breasts, our yes. bits, it doesn't mean to say that we want to see yours. Unless you're invited, don't do it. Most women don't find your tackle attractive. <laughs> Think about, would we ever send a picture of our... Well, I'm, flat? I'm <laughs> guessing some women do, but it depends on the, the site. There are dating sites for every single nuance on yeah. the yeah. And if you want to do that, hmm. do that. That's absolutely fine. But don't do it on the mainstream dating sites. Warning. Oh, dick pick pending. Exactly. You have heard on the site Grinder, is it? Quite a common thing. Gay site. That's perhaps a little bit more normalised. I have gay friends who are in very committed, long-term, loving relationship. I also have gay friends who are utter tartlets. <laughs> Why the hell yeah. not? Men talking to men is different. To men talking to, to women. women. That's true. You're going to resonate on the visual yeah. obsession. There was a gay guy I know, and he said it in a jokey way, but he was serious. He said, flick through the dick pics on the site, more or less, uh, choosing what you're after. And then they come round and you're looking up whose dick is that? Is that which <laughs> face goes with that dick that I've just <laughs> swiped on? I, and I, I, like, I can see a new comedy game show. <laughs> At least you know what you're getting. I would say, and correct me if I'm wrong, but the vast majority of women, the sexual attraction actually comes from more than just your genitalia. I think they're forgetting that women like foreplay is with the mind Absolutely. as well. Absolutely. The mental, the mental connection. Yeah. And to make the woman feel good about Herself. who she is around and you. And yes. Her. That is the sexiest thing. A man who can make you feel good. There is a version of the dick pic which is slightly tamer but just as tasteless. Please don't tell me there's a filter or something. No. I was recently sent a picture of a chap who decided to unsolicited I didn't request it <laughs> send me a picture of him in his tight pants grabbing his todger <laughs> oh fantastic <laughs> that seems like a slightly tamer here's my face as well was his the, face in it no the, f- the face <laughs> was not in the photograph so the, just his hands grabbing onto it through his pants yeah, yeah right. it's very kind of him <laughs> I'm sure <laughs> and I did actually go out on a date after he sent the dick pic I know <laughs> well this yes. sent dick pic and the only reason I did that is because he was only 38 and I needed the ego boost. No! <laughs> At 38, he should still know better. Absolutely. But I forgive um, him because <laughs> we needed it for this. I think you'll be dating for material for this, <laughs> for this from now on. But he was unfortunately exactly what I imagined he would be like. So it was very yeah. much about having a snob like rather a limited than actually thing. getting to know you. Whether he, he knows it or not, he is purely looking for a leg over. <laughs> Even if he doesn't think he is, yeah. he is. Maybe this is the problem that men are deluding themselves and going, oh, <laughs> of course I want to jump into bed on the, the first date. That's how I'm going to get to date. Nah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, I can see that working for you. It doesn't work for me. <laughs> <laughs> it's That was what I was looking for. I think we've already firmly established I'd be going a hell of a lot younger. Yeah. <laughs> the best thing, of course, with going out on the date with him is that I was actually able to pull him up on this. Right. It was his own fault because I was trying to work out how I could 
weave this into the conversation. Yeah. But he led me straight to it when we were talking generally about dating and, and what an arduous process it yeah. be. Then he started talking about dick pics, saying, oh, you know, he doesn't understand why men send dick pics. But you sent one of you in your pants. I think he doesn't consider <laughs> it a dick pic because it's like a clothed dick pic. Yes. <laughs> My friend showed me a video the other day of a guy she knows who sent her a dick video. We went out for breakfast. I was eating a sausage at the time and I was just w- like... Were you sick? Don't <laughs> show it to me because I know who I know him and I just thought I don't want to speak to him. I'll look at him differently. I don't want to see it. And yeah, it was shoved in my face. <laughs> <laughs> Dare I ask what the video entailed? Oh, it was just him shaking it around. <laughs> I didn't look that much. I, didn't want to... I have not yet, touch word, please don't, been instructed in the world of the dick video. <laughs> no. And long may that remain the case. Yeah. <laughs> no, that is not something I think anyone wants to see. Again, it's just this whole thing of why do men imagine that women want to see their tackle? It's not that attractive. No. It, no we get it. You're attracted by our bits and bobs, but it's Maybe not mutual. Think... That's what we just want to. We want to know what's in in your trousers. But to be honest, that comes later. Though, that's doesn't the it? killer of the day. Yeah, it's like the if you want us to not meet you, <laughs> send me one of them because it's just weird. Oh, it's yeah. so strange. Bet you somewhere there are dick pics with rulers whilst fully. Yeah, I mean, instead of the version <laughs> of body count, what's your body count? It would be like what's your centimeters. Oh, <laughs> I mean, can you imagine how rude would that be? Perhaps next time I get asked something inappropriate. Like, how many men are you talking to? Like, how many centimetres are you? Yeah. That would be just as toxic and ridiculous. Oh, dear. Oh yeah, dear. not, not. I want to know what other women... Cause I'm still convinced that it's a woman's fault that men do this because I think there's got to have been a point where women are like, <laughs> okay with it. They keep doing it. I am too polite. What I should have done with Dick Pick and with Mr. Pan is actually call them out on it, wait and go, what the 50th yeah. are you doing sending me this nonsense? You am should, I supposed to be impressed? Should say, I'm not into chipolatas. <laughs> <laughs> Could be something else. Could be really bitchy about it and just say, is, is it mega cold where you are? Yeah. <laughs> I've been sent quite a few dick pics over the years and they sound so surprised that you're not willing to reciprocate. Yeah, no, I'm not. No. Who started it? Who's the woman? Track her down. There's a woman out there, I'm sure of it. From then on, he's told one of his friends and they viraled. Mm. <laughs> Thanks for listening. It's been a really fun episode. <laughs> Let us know your thoughts. Have you? had any is it it the done thing are we just inhibited so maybe we need to be more open-minded no (laughs) we'll catch you next week for yet more stupid cupid bye tune in catch us then see you later